Now, Mill Creek Entertainment did send me over a copy for review, and I did post a full unboxing of this, so I'm not going to go through too much. Uh, it does have uh, a slipcover, and it does have a book about the show. This is actually uh, Series 2. I think I think this one's from 67. It has a 16-hour runtime, and if you guys are into like the old-school Japanese Godzilla and whatnot, it's probably going to be right up your alley. So this one's in color. And it's uh, about this, uh, I don't know, some kind of <laughs> some kind of fictitious uh, military group. And um, this alien comes down chasing this other alien. And he accidentally kills this guy. And so he, like, gives him his life. And so whenever he wants to, he can become Ultraman. And he's kind of this giant humanoid being who can defeat these monsters and so they kind of have all these monsters and aliens and stuff that come and attack and they got to fight them off you know it, it's it's very interesting i i you know it's it's kind of crude obviously compared to today's standards but i really liked a lot of stuff they were doing they really went the extra mile to sell you know they did a lot of models in this one uh, and they really went the extra mile to sell it uh, i think for being in the 60s it's it's really kind of way ahead of its time um, and the blu-ray looks really good i'm very surprised at how good this looks uh, it's a fun show i think the, they're like 30 minute episodes um, definitely want to check out the steelbook is cool uh, i gave this a three and a half out of five